guys, welcome back to another video of all things Apple Plus. We have a great video to show you guys today. I'm gonna show you guys real quick, without the aid of a jailbreak running on iOS 12.1, how to get your badge notifications to change to a different color. Now this is gonna be with, again, without the aid of a jailbreak, and is a really cool, pretty easy trick to pull off that won't take that much of your time, but is a really interesting thing to do, especially now that you're able to customize your phone. Now, especially as the as the days continue to keep going by, we are in the hopes that a jailbreak will eventually come out, but this is a great way, and a very small, but really cool and effective way of customizing your device versus having your normal standard device with the regular red badges for your notifications. But if you haven't already, go ahead and click the link in the description below to Ignition and make sure you open this up in Safari and download the Ignition application like I've shown here. Upon getting the application and downloading it, if you try tapping it, you may get that untrusted enterprise developer notification. Just make sure that you navigate over into settings. From settings, go into general, general, scroll all the way down to profiles and device management. Find your application and make sure that you do trust the application that way you can go ahead and enter into this enterprise app and download the badges application i'm going to show you guys how to get that from here now upon launching ignition you can go ahead and navigate into their their utilities applications and then you can scroll all the way down to find the badges application that will allow you to change the notification button on your apps and if you do receive some sort of notification or some sort of ad, just make sure that you wait to time it down and then you can go ahead and clear the ad accordingly. Now you'll see there's a TornGat-Badges application that you're going to want to install. Go ahead and hit the install button and go ahead and just wait for a moment while you're still in the background just to let the app load while you're in the background and it should load successfully. Now upon seeing the application, it is just a blank app that has no sort of design on the front of it so don't be alarmed by that and then upon launching the application there is a white screen that you'll see it may crash from time to time for me I opened it up the first time and it never and it didn't even crash so there was no issue for me on that end but just if it does crash for whatever reason just go ahead and reinitiate the application now from here you can see that there is a badge color that you can change and currently it's set at red so that is the default red that is set for your iDevice now you can go ahead and change the way that the color looks or the way that the badge looks on your applications by a hexadecimal code now to get that hexadecimal code we need to go into Safari and we're just gonna look up uh, a hex color code that way we can find out what color code we're going to need and to use and many if, even if you put in hex color code you'll be able to come up with a, a plenty of different uh, website searches for that and you can just pick and choose the different colors that you want and I'm going to show you guys real quick a couple of websites just off the top of the list in Google that show or that provide some sort of service for hex codes that way you can if there is a certain color that you want or if you're just looking to pick a just a generic very basic color you can do that as well and the hex code isn't a long code it's about a five to six digit code with a hashtag in the front of it that will allow you just to that once you copy you can paste it into your badges app and it will change the color for you so we have a HTML color picker right here this one looks to be a lot I kind of prefer this one a little bit better than the other ones just the way that the website presents itself I kind of gravitate towards this one so this one is a, uh, a pretty interesting uh, website that I probably would choose so I'll leave the link for this one in the description below so that way if you want to do your own research you can but if you want to choose this one and check this one out you can now upon picking the color I'm going to choose this blue color you can go ahead and see that there is a variety of hex codes that you can use from being from lighter to darker or even just this standard one right here so we are going to copy this code even the hashtag we make sure that you need that hashtag Go ahead and copy this and then we're going to navigate back over to our badges app and we are going to input that into the hex code uh, se search section right there and you should see that it automatically populates to a blue color. We're going to go ahead and dismiss the keyboard there and then from here we can go ahead and change and click the change button at the very bottom to go ahead and implement the actual color change or the color change for the app notification. It will ask you to respring your device. So upon that, we'll notice that after respringing and launching our device, you'll see that we have a blue badge notification. So like on my uh, on, on my messages app, we have that blue 
badge and that shows that the actual application works and that we can go ahead and check out and try any different color that we choose to or choose from here on out. So I hope you guys like this little trick, this little how-to. Again, no jailbreak needed, running on iOS. My phone is running on iOS 12.1 and it works perfectly. So I hope you guys did like this little, little tutorial. If you guys did, please go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, check out my other videos on all things Apple Plus, and I'll be catching you guys on the next video. Peace. That means you're extra, extra, extra.